All right, Shalom. I want to first begin by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai Bahasham, Racha Wadash. Yahweh is the true holy name of the Heavenly Father, who this world ignorantly calls God. Yahweh Shai is the true name of his only begotten Son, who this world ignorantly calls Jesus. The Racha Wadash is the Holy Spirit. Also want to give double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who are the true leaders of the nation of Israel, that Yahweh Bahashim Yahushai has set up through the Holy Spirit to lead and to guide and also to be great examples for the nation of Israel. I also want to say Shalom to the 144,000 men that are laboring and toiling in his work for the sake of Yahweh Bahashim Yahushai. I also want to say Shalom to the innumerable multitude, the men, women, and children, that Yahweh Bashem El Shai will show mercy on in these last days. I'm the brother Gabar from the GMS West Palm Beach Camp. I'm coming back with another lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem El Shai. And Lord willing, this lesson is edifying unto the hopeful elect. All right, so this is another early morning flow on my way to the uh, plantation. And, um, you know, I just want to. Uh, touch on something that I mentioned in my last early morning flow um, Going to the, the book of Isaiah the 53rd chapter All right, and um, you know, I just want to touch on the um, subject of us not being uh, Actually, let me just get the scripture That I'm uh, thinking about and then I'm gonna go to uh, the book of um, Isaiah the 53rd chapter All right, so this is um uh, let's, go, let's go to John 15. I'm going to jump down in verse 19 and get straight to the point. All right, it's John 15 and verse 19. If ye were of the world, the world would love its own, you know, but we're not of this world. All right, we're, we're contrary to this world. All right, because this world is against Yahweh Bashram Shah. All right, this world hates the Most High and His only begotten Son. You know, and you can, you know that through, through the, through the, um, through the mannerisms, all right? You know that through the spirit, all right? It really is, it's, it's really plain. You know, you turn on your television, everything that's, everything is wicked, everything is abominable, all right? And it says, but because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, Therefore, the world hateth you. You see, and the world is going to show that hate, especially in the times that we're about to approach, the time of Jacob's trouble, all right? The time of uh, persecution, you know? The world is going to show that hate, you know? And they are already showing that now, all right? But how much more in a time of Jacob's trouble, all right? How much more when Esau, Edom, comes down with great wrath because he knoweth that he has but a short time, you know? And some, some of our family members are going to betray us, all right, and uh, persecute us, okay? Just go to the point, verse 20, and it reads, Remember the word that I said unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord. And that's the point that I wanted to emphasize on this lesson. The servant is not greater than his Lord, okay? And you read about Yahweh Shai and his walk. All right, Yahweh Shai, when he got uh, put up on that cross, okay, and we're 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 um, we're walking that walk as well. Us, that's of the hopeful elect. All right, we're 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 being chastised. All right, by the heavenly Father and His only begotten Son. You know, our family comes up against us. Okay people that you don't even know when you out on your day to day all right because um, the people in the world they see that they see that light all right they see the spirit upon us you know and that's why that's why we that's why we going through the things that we go through all right because the world is in, in a state of gross darkness as it as it says in Isaiah the 60th chapter you know, but we're walking around with that light. And what do roaches 
or, or what, what do roaches do when they see the light? They scatter. All right, that's why a lot of roaches, they come out at nighttime, you know, but when you turn on the kitchen light and you, and you see the roaches, what they do, they hurry up and scatter. All right, so we, we, we are the light of the world. You know, and, and, and the rest of the world, they, they, they hate that light. All right, and it says, if they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. Right, man, we gotta be ready mentally to go through that persecution, all right? Because it ain't about how many push-ups you could do, okay? It ain't about how many precepts you can quote, all right? It's about, are you gonna apply the, are you gonna apply the scriptures, okay? So right now is that time for us to begin preparing for the time of persecution by way of taking out that time for your how about Shemel Shai, man. Okay? And it says, if they have kept my sayings, they will keep yours also. Okay? Hey, man, persecution is coming. All right? And Esau, Edom, he gonna try to use um, the, these lessons that we make, all right, to, to help demonize us. All right? But that's all we doing is preaching the truth. All right? That's all we doing is reading out of, the, out of the scriptures. You know? And your how about Shemal Shah is going to uh, defend us, man. Lord willing, we be at that number. All right? But let's go to Isaiah, the 53rd chapter. And I'm going to start at verse 3. And it reads, He is despised and rejected of men. Yahweh Shah, right? He says, A man of, of sorrows and acquainted with grief. You see? So that's why I brought out the servant is not greater than his than his Lord. Okay, because Yahweh Shah, he his life wasn't all sweet and kisses and rainbows. Alright? And neither is his servants. That's that's following after Yahweh by Shemel Shah. Alright? We going through sorrows, man. You know, brothers and sisters are going are going through a lot. Alright? And it says, and acquainted with grief, it says, and we hid as it were our faces from him. He was despised and we esteemed him not. Right, man. And and that's the same spirit that these two thirds come in. All right. They, they, they despise us for going out to the highways and byways diligently, preaching the truth. All right. Trying to wake up our people. All right. Trying to, trying to, uh, Trying to tell our people, that's all we do is trying to tell our people that you ain't black, you ain't Hispanic, you ain't no Jamaican, you ain't no uh, uh, Haitian, all right? But you're a, you a king, you're a prince, all right? You ain't, you're you, you a Hebrew Israelite from whatever sp per, uh, perspective tribe you're from. It says, it says, surely he had borne our grief and carried our sorrows. Yet we did esteem him stricken, smitten of the most high and afflicted. But he was wounded for our transgressions. Right, man. Yahweh Shai was wounded for our transgressions. And now this the, the, the way that we uh try to pay uh Yahweh Shai back is by making our bodies a living sacrifice. Alright, as it mentions in Romans the twelfth chapter. Alright. Now we give up we give up our time. Our, our lust. We give up our dreams and aspirations to follow after Yahweh Shai. All right, and suffer as he suffered. It says, He was wounded for our transgressions. He was a bruise for our iniquities. Right, and that's why Yahweh Shai uh, went through that suffering as the way he did on that cross. You know? He got pierced. All right, he got beat. The scripture says he got marred more than any man. All right, because he was taking on the sins of the nation of Israel. Okay, and it says the chastisement of our peace was upon them, and with his stripes we are healed. Right, so through the blood of Yahweh Shai, we are healed. All right, beginning with his elect. Ultimately, his blood is going to is going to be covered for all of the nation of Israel. But on this side. 
his blood was shed for his elect, man. All right? And that's the, that's the, that's the least that we can do is continue to serve Yahweh by Shemal Shai. All right? Continue to suffer as Yahweh Shai suffered. But Yahweh Shai, he, he suffered much, much more than, than what we going through. All right? And that's why the scripture says it's a light affliction. You know, compared to what Yahweh Shai went through, it's a light affliction. All right? And it says, verse 6, all we like sheep have gone astray. Right? When we 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 departed from Yahweh by Shemal Shai. All right? We were serving idol gods. All right? We was eating abominable foods. You know? We was getting tattoos. We was dying our hair. We was... We was going to we was going to hell off. Okay? And that and that and that should keep us humble. Alright, and it says, We have turned every one to his own way, and the Lord have laid on him the iniquity of us all. You know, man, and, and that's we down in the spirit, man. And you think that think that you catch a hell, man, it's 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 a humbling when you read this chapter, man, because ain't hey, nobody is went through what Yahweh Shai went through. Alright? Hey, and that's why Yahweh Shai deserves all the praise, all the glory, all the honor. Okay, and that's why he's going to be that's why he's going to be exalted more than more than all the rest. Alright? So that was just a lesson that I wanted to bring out through the spirit. Alright, I pray that this lesson was edifying unto the hopeful elect. I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, or Kakwadash. Double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 men that are laboring and toiling in his work for the sake of Yahweh Bahashem al I also want to say Shalom to the innumerable multitude, the men, women, and children that Yahweh Bahashem al will show mercy on in these last days. The Wadi Yahweh Bahashem al forgive me the spirit of truth. The Wadi Yahweh Bahashem al forgive me the Holy Spirit. The Rechak would to make this lesson. Lord willing, until the next lesson, I'm going to say Shalom and a Baba Ball. DTA, Kwame Yashallah, Shalom.